Hey guys, welcome, welcome, welcome back to my channel. It's Nick Snowell here, and we're back with another video. We're back with Nicky Reacts, and for today's video, we're gonna be reacting to Nick's Top 5. Yes, Nick's Top 5. Top 5 scary ghost videos, so we'll make you pitch a hissy fit because why not? Who likes to throw tantrums here and there, you know? Raise your hand because that's not me. Comment down below if you like to throw tantrums and if you hate seeing people throw tantrums, then comment down below. Yes, we're gonna be reacting to Nick's Top 5. I mean, I do love Lord of Darkness because, bruh, videos are like spot on, brother. But then New Stuff 5 is like how I started this real reaction channel. It's because of New Stuff 5. Any who's in, have you guys seen my moon and ghost? Yeah, it's Halloween season and every, not really every video, but there are gonna be some videos where I have like upgrades, you know, like I might have like my name up there or so, somewhat, yeah. If you guys haven't yet, please do subscribe. Click that little bell right next to it, tickle it, make it look. It'll help your girl out. And if you guys haven't seen my last video, this will be a link on the screen. Click the moon, click the ghost, click down here. I don't know where it might be. Somewhere up here, I believe. So yeah, let's get into watching and see if we're gonna be throwing tantrums at the end of this video. Oh, oh, from the dark doorway. Okay. Popular Japanese ghost hunters Hiro and Tomo from the YouTube channel Omagatoki Film travel to a mysterious abandoned house that is said to be extremely haunted. The story goes that years ago a married couple was living in the house. The wife descended into madness and late one night in a fit of rage she violently took her husband's life. Oh wow. And then Out of nowhere? Okay. These days, the house has been abandoned for over 10 years. Oh, Japan, why you gotta be like that? ...near the place, and it is believed that some evil presence haunts the home. But that doesn't stop the Omagatoki film team. Investigators Hiro and Tomo vow to spend the night and explore the infamously haunted house. Curious, curious people. The two guys decide to split up. Hiro goes back to the car and Tomo stays to explore the second floor. As Tomo looks around, he finds an opening into the attic. There he finds old clothes and pictures of the family that once lived there. Oh God. Tomo calls Hiro to tell him what he's found. Oh. But there is something else going on that is downright chilling. Watch very closely. Watching. The video is pretty blurry though. <laughs> I'm not like looking through the doorway. Oh, Tomo experiences odd interference when attempting to phone Hiro. And did you see? Oh gosh, see what? That's what I was looking at. Someone appears to be peeking out at him from a dark doorway. Good heavens, unaware brother! Of what he has just captured, Tomo heads down to the car to meet up with Hiro. What? That's what I was looking at. I thought it was just like a blurry, like video. Absolutely terrifying. Oh, they captured on the static. Oh, okay. Gotta see that. So, oh, oh, my word, dude! I'm having body chills. Well, mostly on my legs, but brother, it's right. I'm literally having chills on my legs. I'm having major, major, major goosebumps. Oh gosh, the head is moving. Oh gosh, oh my gosh, oh my word. Brother. The figure of a woman can be seen in the doorway, just kind of standing there. Just there. there. Just there. They're shocked so to could their this core. be the apparition of the woman who went mad inside the house? Probs, oh or my just god. just who, or what, is this? It might be, I believe that 100%. It might be the woman. This entire it might be. Two -part investigation yeah. on the YouTube channel, Omagatoki Film. Meanwhile, on TikTok. Okay. TikTok, TikTok user Tim Saver says that he's a new night Maybe. guard at an undisclosed facility. He says that he's the only guard willing to work the night shift, and for good reason. Okay. That's gonna open. Okay. Okay. Someone. Someone's mad. Someone's up the vents. What's that, freak? Dude. I don't think this can. 
A light flashes and a hatch leading to the upper attic space opens and closes on its own. Oh, there's an attic space. Gathering his courage, Tim grabs a ladder and climbs up into the attic to investigate. What is he? What happens next is downright chilling. Oh, gosh. I'm not capture something like... The way he's panning his video, his camera, the way he's panning it, oh my god. What is that? The freak is that? Some sort of figurine. Creepy face figurine though. Yeah, what the freak is that? That better not come flying to him. You see that thing fly across his face like that. Ooh. Yo. Did that get bigger? Oh, ew, there was a hand. A creepy bell hand seems that to was come a out of nowhere hand. and wraps around a small statue sitting on the attic floor. Even stranger, there appears to be no arm yeah. or no body. Attached to the hand. That's gross. Tim quickly gets out of there. What is this, the Adams family? So, is it real? Thing? Or is it all just an elaborate TikTok hoax? TikTok user Brianna's videos are mostly dedicated to her favorite pastime free diving in the beautiful waters just off the coast of sunny Florida. She captures something truly chilling. Okay. Oh, okay, yeah, I saw this one on Lord of Darknesses. Yeah, screaming. And she mentions after that nothing can be like overlaid to this because she was using a GoPro. Interesting. She might have just gone through something haunted there, like little like little airway, not airway, like pathway. It's like haunted. She goes down again to try to figure out just what is going on. And she finds nothing. So, people are asking what camera I use. GoPro 7 works perfectly fine for me. I cracked it a little bit, but I use the case. Um, Definitely not a voiceover though, so I'm going to show you the video straight out of my GoPro. Just like how I recorded it. So you can hear. Yeah. That's definitely a scream. When I was watching on Lord Darkness, that's, a, there's, that's the first thing I said. It's probably just an overlay. Like, a, like an audio overlay. Yeah. That's so like heartbreaking to hear screams like that. You have no idea what they've been through or what they what they were going through at that moment. It's so heartbreaking. This next creepy video was uploaded to TikTok by Rosie B from Michigan. The home security clip shows Rosie's daughter strolling through the kitchen when the toddler seems to have a very odd and chilling encounter. Okay. Kid Oh, he's just, she just stopped. She's talking. Something. That. Mm, I believe that one. That. Mm, has to be real. At first, the girl appears to be talking. That has to be real. We can't see. I believe that 100%. Something seems to try to yank a plastic container of snacks. It's like a bully. Her hand. It's like a bully trying to get someone's lunch. It's like, give me your lunch, give me your lunch. The toddler puts up a fight and wins, and then just walks away. Seemingly like, give me all your lunch. whoever or whatever was grabbing at her things. It's like a big bully. Later, when Rosie asks her daughter about what happened, the little girl says that a young boy and girl we're trying to take away her toys. Oh, those two of them. Two bullies. Looking at the video, Say no to bullying, guys. No, one there. No, no bully. At least no one that we can see. It's two bullies. So is the little girl fighting over toys with the ghosts of two children? Yup. Let me know what you think. My Haunted Hotel.
Over 400 years ago, all the way back in 1622, the old King's Head Inn was built in Chester, England. It is said that at least 13 ghosts haunt the old inn, ghosts. including a man in black that roams the haunted hotel and the ghost of a young are all child. The, 13 active? the many spirits of the inn are said to frequently oh. interact with visitors and guests, especially in the inn's many bedrooms. Interact These how? days, the old King's Head still serves as a hotel bar and restaurant and is now owned by Harry Achilleos. As a paranormal enthusiast himself, Harry has a grand plan for the old King's Head Hotel. He wants to capture real evidence of paranormal activity at the inn and let hotel guests experience it as well. Wow, I love that for him. There's a lot of them in there too. Wow, very active. Harry, along with huh. his friends and fellow paranormal investigators, They're not afraid of like a crowd or anything. They actually like crowds. To record multiple angles of every room in the hotel. Visitors can now rent rooms to explore and seek out their own paranormal experience. Unless the owner rigged the rooms. The owner and his team carefully monitor their guests on the 16 video feeds, both to make sure that everyone is safe and to capture paranormal you evidence. Make sure they're safe. The old King's Head team have collected hours of creepy unexplained footage, and they share their spookiest moments over on their YouTube channel, My Haunted Hotel. Now, the guests that come to the hotel are usually not paranormal investigators in any way. Yeah, in fact, most of them have never even encountered people. anything paranormal at all. So sometimes the visitors can be a little bit jumpy. A little? Guess Whoa, Christy that's a lot of them. with fear when she is a asked little. to investigate the hotel's cellar all by herself. While she's down there alone in the dark, something happens that scares the living sh out of her. Huh, lol. Oh, oh, day. oh, I feel for you, girl. Oh. Literally feel for oh you. Oh my god, this is the worst thing I've ever done my whole entire life. Lol. <laughs> oh, that's just a bug. That's <laughs> oh. oh. the one answer. <laughs> Oh, oh wow. <laughs> oh, it's the generator. It's the generator. Oh, scared the bejeebies. I even scared them. Oh my goodness. They got a little jumpy. Eerie silence is suddenly my goodness. By a roar as the hotel's generator turns on without even they got spooked by their own generator. Nearly <sighs> jump right out of her skin. Even the My Haunted Hotel team jump at the sudden noise, exactly. but they quickly laugh it off when they well, realize that it's just their generator. But then scaring the people with their generator. Come on. I just can't explain. Like that's enough for your heart to drop. No. Oh. Whoa. Whoa, what was that though? What the heck was that? What the hell just happened? What was that? It's weird because your camera is not pointing in that direction. Just... Exactly. What, just to try and explain here, the, the generator's just gone off in the cellar. Um, Kirsty's obviously crapped herself as it's happened. Oh my goodness. We, it got us, but something has happened here off camera that has made her now run out of the cellar. We have to radio through and make sure they're okay. She Why literally sprinted out of there. To find the girls, girls, where are you? Eh? What, what was it off camera? Something just went off. And then I ran. <laughs> so obviously the generator's not paranormal, but then the no, bang that the you bang hit. Was no, it's not. That was not nothing not like normal. On a different night, guests Janine and Lottie are investigating the hotel's most haunted room, room five. Okay. This room is said to be a hot spot for paranormal activity. The child Burn. ghost that roams the hotel is said to be particularly active in this room. Okay. So the space has been decorated with dolls and toys. Like the kids' room. And it seems like the two oh gosh, this is why I don't have dolls in my room. Hello, children. You've got a toy here. You can change the lights on it. Oh. What was that? What was that? Are you just giggling? <laughs> what was that? What are those? Okay. I'm sorry, but I'm like seeing orbs over the camera. I don't know if that's like 
bugs, insects, or orbs. They were to locate exactly where it came from. And a doll sitting on a shelf in the corner falls to Yeah, the orb just went right to the doll. That's when the doll fell. My haunted hotel team are all shocked by the experience. But Janine is a bit of a skeptic and attempts to debunk what just happened. Okay. But she chooses a very, very odd method to debunk the incident. Oh. What is she you doing? Evil, Nikki. Oh, you evil Nicky. You evil Nicky. You evil Nicky. No, 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 no. Nicky, don't do that. <laughs> no. Right. Oh. Nicky, oh my, my. Oh god, I think you do move. Right, I've jumped up and down in front yeah. of it and it's not moved. No. Right. Okay, they're debunking it. Okay. I ain't clapping the dog. It's my move. Not going off again. Right, are you in the room with it? Oh my god! <laughs> There's an orb that was a. Oh my god. <laughs> We're in, we're in room I'm five. Body chills. Oh my goodness. Started off very quiet and active. Um, very active room. About three quarters of an hour into it, um, we had a huge thud on the wall, and the doll literally Fell flew off. off the shelf. So now we cut to another night weeks later, and the scariest moment ever captured inside the hotel occurs when a staff member is simply locking up the downstairs bar for the night as the guests are all in their rooms. These are some creepy dolls. We'll put these things in their room. What the freak was that noise? Watch closely as staff member Tom, who has just locked the downstairs bar, comes to drop the keys off. And as he enters the function room, a clear baby crying is heard coming from the old brothel. What in the actual for real, man? I don't see a baby. Yeah. What in the, oh uh, mama. They're having so much fun in their hotel. Yeah. Capturing a whole bunch of yeah. paranormal. So much fun. I'd have fun. Oh, okay. The dining. Still crying. Oh my gosh, I'm having body chills. Oh my gosh. I don't see a baby. Yeah. No duh, you won't have huh? a baby in your hotel. Unattended. Who said yeah? Did you see a baby? Yeah. See a baby crying. What the f Weird world. Weird world. South oh. Haven, Michigan resident Jennifer says Portal? she was at a festival Portals? when she noticed something very odd going on in the sky above her. She grabbed her phone okay. and started to record. I gotta see this. Alright, everybody sees me walking. I'm walking. Mm -hmm. Look. This plane. Is it moving? It's just there. It's not moving. What is, and what's attached to it, too? But it sounds like it's moving. Whoa. Now, Jennifer claims that the small airplane had been flying in the same spot not moving at all for hours before she finally decided to grab her phone and record the video. As you can see in the clip, many others also noticed mm -hmm. the strange plane and filmed it as it is seemingly frozen in the sky. Could wow. it be that Jennifer captured a quote, glitch in the matrix? Or is there some simpler explanation? I honestly don't you know. Tell me. Keepers of the Old Church. Of the old church. Paranormal yeah. investigators Jeff and Phil from the YouTube channel Ghost Tech Paranormal Investigation set out to investigate rumors of an allegedly haunted church deep in the woods of Bedham, England, the Old Mission Church. The historic building is now in ruins, but the church grounds is said to be extremely haunted by the ghosts of long ago. You know that history and hauntings go hand in hand. As I was saying, you know, I'd asked for your name. And it may well be that you've told me your name and I just can't hear it. You, you have to shout as loud as you can. Um, oh, wow. Okay. Something touched my hand. Something just touched my hand. I'm trying to talk into your device, probably. Okay. Let me introduce myself. My name's Jeff. 
and my friend and colleague standing there holding a camera, his name is Phil. When the building had a roof, doors, windows, perhaps pews? Ooh. What was that? What was that, Jeff? black mast went right in between me and you mm -hmm. and went over here. Is there a replay? Could you come back, please? Perhaps pews? Ooh. Yeah, okay, I see that now. What was that, From Jeff? another angle. You gotta see it from another angle. Okay. Has to be something... Perhaps pews? Ooh. Okay. And they kind of like, they kind of like, a strange step shadow back. passes between Jeff and Phil, but because they're filming in the dark with infrared, Phil just can't see it. Can't However, see Jeff it. spots the figure on the infrared camera and is shocked. After they leave, the camera inside the church captures another strange event that Jeff and Phil simply can't explain. camera like just messes up so focus. could the church be haunted by the children who tragically lost their lives wow. in the 1919 influenza Still outbreak active. you decide okay nuke top five that was a uh, nuke top five top five scary ghost videos that will make you pitch a hissy fit and so are you guys throwing tantrums right now are you guys pitching a hissy fit Comment down below if you guys are throwing tantrums because I'm not quite throwing tantrums because I don't throw tantrums. So comment down below which is your favorite video. My favorite video would have to be the two ghost kids fighting over the child or the kid's toys because it just feels so real, it feels so genuine because it is a child. You can't edit anything a child involved, especially coming from a camera that's a static camera or probably like a security camera that was captured on so I don't think that was edited or something so yeah if you, if you guys like these type of videos these type of reaction videos please comment down below and leave a like on the video if you guys haven't yet please do subscribe click that notification bell so you know I don't every time I post a brand new video follow me on Instagram because why not more haunted videos coming so excited for Halloween I'm literally crossing my fingers so I can get that exploration date so I can like explore the mansion the historical mansion that is said to be haunted especially the rooftop so yeah i would love to explore that one and get its history and do some tours hopefully i get to book and edit before halloween so that would have to be my halloween special my first ever really in-depth exploration video like haunted video haunted exploration video so yeah i'll see you guys in my next video bye